Okay guys, more Mafia 3. We are on episode number 5 now, and last episode we dealt with the Dixie Mafia. They have moved inside of Hollow, which is our former territory before the Mafia killed all of us. Again, the Mafia still thinks I'm dead, but we were able to mess with the daily operations of the Dixie Mafia, lure out one of their bosses, and murder him. So they're on notice now, bitches. So I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing now. Let's see if I can, uh, that's not the button I meant to hit. Let's go ahead and open up the mini-map and see what we've got here. Looks like maybe this one. Let's find a car. Hi! Car? Stop, please. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Oh my god, I shot her in the head. She's going to call the cops. We can't have that. Hang on. Stop it. No cops. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, let me go to Donovan's. This game. Shut up! Did you see what I just did here? You don't want that to happen to you. Alright, I need to learn to drive. Oh my god, look at this mess I'm making out here. Just run over the body. Okay, alright, I'm heading over to the waypoint now. Alright, looks like we're here. I think we just need to stop and wait here. Excuse me. Sorry, I'm on a mission. It's important. It's all about revenge, okay, lady? Let me get out. I think I need to get out. Everyone calm down. All right, we're going to sit here and wait for Donovan. Donovan's our CIA contact, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, I'm that's him. to see you out here. <laughs> Decided to get some fresh air. That heroin the Dixie Mafia's been selling? It's run out of there by a man named Charlie Kincaid. Meaning all the other dealers around here kick up to him. Charlie stays away if he can help it, so you're going to have to put the squeeze on him. I flagged a couple of his guys. You get them to talk, they'll tell you how to get to him. Now, from what I hear, Charlie's only in this for the money. He's not a true believer like those other Dixie Mafia assholes. So maybe if I talk sweet to him, he'll decide to bail on Doucette and come work for me. Assuming I can draw him out. I got something I can help you with that. That's what I wanted to show you. New Bordeaux's on a standard communication grid. So getting a system of wiretaps up and running should be fairly easy. Just install this little beauty on a junction box, and I'll be able to construct an intelligence map of the nearby area. How many more of these you got? Just those. The parts are on an agency watch list. But if you manage to dig up more of them, we could wiretap the entire city. All right. Ah, oh, damn it! People think living under these commie motherfuckers is so great they should move their asses over to Moscow. When you find more of these, you bring them to me. You are way too sensitive about that shit, man. Oh, fuck those motherfuckers. Fucking traitors. Yeah! I'll see you when it's time to move against Charlie. <laughs> All right, looks like we're flushing out somebody here, but look, we can wiretap the First Baptist Church, so let's do that. All right, so doing a little research there, it says that by doing this, we can see uh, points of interest in a particular area, and it'll also show us where like collectibles and stuff are located at. Right there, ought to do it. And I missed. Okay, try again. Try again. Now, got it, got it. This is probably illegal. Probably want to be a little smart about this. I see some red markers on the uh, mini-map. Okay, interrogate informants to gather intel on racket and racket bosses. Yep, 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 we're going to get him to sk spill it all. He'll tell us everything we want to know, and then I'm going to kill him. That's how we do things. When you're playing like, okay, there's two bad guys. I should kill one of them and interrogate the other what one. What you gonna do, huh? Word from on high is stick to the hollow with this shit. My thinking, old man Marcano don't know Georgie and Richie. I think we can kill both these guys. You wanna be one shit around when you had the team? Shit, I missed him. Run! Get out of here! Jesus Christ! We have to get out of here! Let's get bloody, motherfucker! I'm gonna barbecue your ass! Just get me close enough, boys. Let's unlock this door real quick. Oh, it's not locked. Open it. What's in here? Why would this be shut? I'm fucking trapped, y'all. Ready to hit him. I'm coming out there. I don't want to kill you. Oh shit, he's getting away. Time to take out the trap. Crap! Gonna plug him. We gotta get that guy. I need a car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car! Oh, get out of the car! 
Oh, don't end the mission. Don't end the mission. We're not pursuit. I will interrogate this man before the day is over. Oh, that's a bad idea. Oh, it'll be a river. Oh, it's a river. Shit. <laughs> Shit. That man's getting away. I don't see a car on this side anywhere. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Boom. Uh-uh. He ain't going nowhere. Get out the car. Get out the car. Get out the car. Down. We going for a ride. All right. What the hell are you doing? What's four finger got going on at the church? Says to drive like a madman. Drive dangerously. If I drive too slow, he'll run for it. So let's just drive crazy. All right, this is my kind of mission. Better hope I don't find me a damn jump. Cause I'll hit it with everything I've got. You don't intimidate me. Tell me what I need to know. Whoa. I ain't dying for you, asshole. You think this is a fucking game? Oh shit! Oh god! Don't let him out! Don't let him out! If you drive too slow. Get out and run. Ugh. All right. Let's just go really fast down this road. Try not to hit the other cars. I think if we get that speeding bar all the way up, we should be good. Actually, we can I take him on the train track. Fucking got me. Stop wasting my fucking time. Holy Woo! shit! Holy shit! Woo! Slow down! Slow down! Your time's running out! Oh, don't let the bar go down. Slow down! Slow down! I'm not Slow slowing down, down for nobody. Talk, goddammit! Speeding bar is almost all the way full. We should get him to spill his guts here in a second. Cows and dope over to church. He just told us. I can recruit him, or I can kill him. I don't know. I think I'm gonna kill him. Sorry, ass motherfucker. Boom. You're gonna swing, huh? You're dead. Just leave him right there. All right, now we're supposed to go to the church. I think I did the missions backwards, guys. Whatever. Let's go to the church. There'll be less for us to worry about there, I guess. You know, one thing I do want to check, though, before we get into this mission is if you could blow up the gas station pumps. I don't know why I feel like I need to check that right now, but I'm going to, so let's find out. If we shoot at these gas station pumps, will they explode? The answer is yes. They explode. I feel like we can go back to our mission now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no! I just got this car, fuck! Okay. Alright, I'm back at the church. I'm back at the church. Alright, let's park that there. Look how nice this truck is that I borrowed from a civilian. I dented it a little bit. But it was pretty. Alright, let's try this again. I don't think I was supposed to do this earlier, but... Yeah, we're gonna sneak right up on this guy and choke him out. Oh shit! Bull rush, boom! Lights out, bitch. All right. Step one of being stealthy. Yeah, this is exactly what we, these two guys are talking over here. Oops. All right. Quiet now. Huh? Shut up! Go to sleep, bitch! Devil's making his presence known. Right, I just whistled to see if we'll come over. Oh, they're all coming over here? That was not part of the plan. Here we go, it's about to pop off! Oh, oh shoot him! Where are you going? Oh, no, 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 no! Ain't calling nobody. You ain't calling nobody. Not today, not ever. Anybody else? Oh. Zombie trap there. Oh. It's a church. It's a place of worship. Oh, 
fuck, he's gonna kill me. Not anymore, he's not. Alright, we're good. I think we just cleared the church. I think we did well. Looks like we have a waypoint inside here. And we'll check it out. we to take this just in case. Yeah, remember earlier, this wasn't locked. So I should explain, you keep hearing me say we did this early, we did this earlier. I just happened to wander into this section earlier and get into it with all these guys. It wasn't part of a mission, but I guess they're here in this church permanently until you start this mission. So I already fought all these dudes. I'm doing it again. I edited that part out so you wouldn't see two things of the same. All right, that's it. You're caught up. All right, I think we're about to get into it here. Is there any health anywhere first before we go in there? Yes, there is. Let's do this. All right, that didn't seem to do anything for me. Thanks for nothing. I've got half a health bar. I'm going in. Good idea, bad idea, don't know. Oh, we got to break it open. Okay. Find the sweet spot. There it is. And get it going and wait for it. And now. Oh, what the hell is going on in here now? This wasn't here earlier. Oh, she's naked. You know why they do that? So they keep an eye on their employees as to not, to make sure they're not stealing the product. How the hell am I supposed to do this? All right, everybody's about to die. Sorry. It's all right, shut up. Let this happen. Just doing my job, which I fucking love. Come on. Huh? You like that? Because now you're dead. So I think we can break this shit? No, no. Maybe I'm supposed to... Oh, okay. Yeah, we're supposed to destroy it. Yeah, that's how we do stuff. Nice. We're, we're destroying all their profit. Take that, heroin. I'll beat you with my crowbar. Yeah. This is how it works in real life. You beat the shit out of heroin with a crowbar, and they can't sell it anymore. All right. Interrogate Charlie Smack Pushers. They appear to be in this... This here shop double barrel bar all right we're going in a bar huh all right you a good guy or a bad guy I think you're fine you're just a, let's take a look on this back door here nobody pay attention to this oh I missed it got it Well, those guys aren't paying attention. What's this? What the hell's in here? Oh, nothing. <laughs> it's not a thing. All right, so we want to interrogate this man. He's got like a bodyguard with him or something. All right, here we go. Huh? You die? You're not getting out of here. Now listen here. Need some answers. The over here. You gotta Nail, tell God me about the dope it. operation. Hey, you on out, I call the shots. I added him to my racket. But the cops are coming now. Great! What is this? Nice Playboy magazine. I always gotta I'm gonna rob this place too while I'm here. Give me all the damn money. I think I got it. Alright, cops are coming. We're about to have a shootout with the coppers. Do I have any ammo for this? Oh god, not really. Okay, I don't know what I'm going to do here. <laughs> How many cops do you think are coming in? Alright, copper. Just you? He's got partner outside. Should have brought him in. Now radio to him. Let him know you're dead. You got any ammo? No sign here. Let's check over there. Oh god, I'm in so much trouble now. I stole the cop car. Oh. Go, you in. Oh my god, they're so pissed. Here we go. Oh boy, our first high speed chase with the coppers. Oh, we're not getting out of this one alive. Oh, they're just opening fire on me. It sounds like there's a freaking like helicopter shooting an M60 at me right now. 
Oh, we lost a tire, I'm sure of that. Yep, no front left tire. That's fine. They are so, they're on our ass. Oh, what are we gonna do? We gotta bail and get another vehicle. There's a used car dealership right there, perfect. Watch out, civilians! Watch out! Oh, I'm sorry, I killed two of them. Oh my god, it's a park. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, we have no tires on the left side. We're still in the middle of a mission, too. Why can't I just behave long enough to do these missions? Ugh. But I lost a cop there. No, nope, didn't lose one at all. All right, I'm 100 meters away. I got to kill somebody over here. All right, we'll get to him in a minute. I gotta lose these cops somehow. Uh, up in the mountains. That's where we'll lose them. I'm sure of it. Here we go. Hopefully we have enough steam to get up here. Oh, no we don't. Get out now. Get out now. Rod Lincoln! Serpentine. Serpentine formation. Okay. I saw like a tunnel up here. I thought I saw a tunnel up here from the road. They lost visual contact? Are they too lazy to get out and do a foot chase? Hey, we might have done it, gang. We might have gotten out of here. Yeah, there's a train tunnel or something right below us here. All right. What a rush. I'll just jump down on the next car and we'll be out of here. That's the plan anyways. I got to... Oh my God, Lincoln. You've seen better days. Got to time it just right. And now. Oh, a little too soon. I'm dead. Fuck. All right, I think the cops are off our ass now. I mean, they're still in the area looking for us, but I changed vehicles and everything, so I'm gonna go kill this guy now. I think that's the play. So let's do it. The cops are like a block away, so let's just go murder a man. All right, so we've got multiple bad guys. We got one right out in the street here too. Watch it. All right, gun out. All right, there's a few of them down here. Where's my target? Which one's the man? Oh, he's right below me. Okay. So should I just stay up here? Maybe. Yeah, let's just stay up here and let's lay into it. Oh, I think they see me. Making a killing today. We shake it off and move. Ain't we just in the right place and the right time? All right, two down. This is easy. Another one down. And he's just in there, sitting in there by himself. All right. Guys, the cops are like a block away. Stop with the automatic weapons. Be a gentleman about this. Oh, they called off the search for me. Oh, there he is. I'm coming down to deal with you, buddy. Let me just wound you first. Let me wound you. Little little leg shot there. Uh, need some adrenaline. I don't have any. Crap. All right, wait for myself to heal. All right, I'm down here. I'm coming. I'm going to finish you off with hand-to-hand -hand combat. Heal, 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 heal. Oh, shit. <laughs> no. All right, he's reloading. Get him, get him, get him. Now's the time. Ow. Damn, he... Oh. oh. This dude's tough. There we go. Here comes the brutal takedown. Oh, yes. I just shoved his face inside out with my boot. Give me your damn sniper rifle, too, buddy. All right. There's one more we got to go kill right down the road. All right, nobody on this alley looks suspicious. You heard from Mama? <clears throat> Sorry. What the hell is going on in this back alley? There's a bunch of drug addicts, I think. Yeah, yeah. I already done told you that. Pardon me. 
is the last time I'm now. Oh shit. Man. Go go go. Go go go. Go go go. So I'm bitch right there. You think it's wise about now. Ain't going nowhere. There we go. I think that was one of them. Oh, there's another one. Get away from here. God. Brutal takedown. Oh! Hit him with the fire. I'm coming in there. Run that oh shit, he throw fire! Damn, cops are coming down. No, they're not. Run as fast as you can. Come on, come get your man. He's still alive. He's right there. Come get him. I'm trying to shoot him in the shoulder. I want to fight him again. I love fighting these guys. It's gonna get me killed though. Yeah, I just kill him. Screw it. Got time for that. Hey, buddy! Go to sleep. Oh! Jesus Christ! Okay. Oh, another one! Who's this guy? There! Ha ha! Excellent! And we are here! Park that. There we go. Get out. Use the uh, pole to stop the car. And voila. Continue. I've been listening in on old Charlie. And he isn't such a bad fellow. He's more of a kinder, gentler redneck. And as luck would have it, his wife is expecting. Man in that situation usually doesn't care who he works for. As long as he's still above ground. <laughs> Poor sap starts blubbering when the two of them talk about names. Right now, it's between Bocephus and Thomas Lee. Anyway, his guys have the church locked down, and all of them are more of the shoot first, let God sort them out variety of redneck. You get your hands on Charlie, though. He'll do what he's told without putting up much of a fuss. All your intel's been updated. You going back to the motel? After I get something to eat, I'll see you when you're done dealing with these inbred assholes. All right. Looks like we finally get to meet the Charlie guy we got to get through all of his his men first though and then uh potentially we're going to talk charlie into working for us but that looks like they have got uh, three cars full of bad guys we're going to deal with that's no problem for lincoln and pals we got this all right guys i'm back in the church property again and this time i was real stealthy i've already killed like four people and no one even knows it yet make that five i see centuries we got to watch out for they're the ones that like to go run into the damn phones and call people for backup. If they see you, you're kind of screwed, so let's be careful here. Alright. Right next to this guy. Oh, he's got a buddy back there, though. Alright. How do we get this fella to move? I'm going to try the whistle. Get him down here. Choke his ass out. Perfect. Perfect. All right, let's go in the garage real quick. See if there's anything in here. It might be helpful. We got medicine. We're fine. There's weapons. Okay. Oh, good. It's got a ballistic uh, jacket in there. Bulletproof vest. Thanks. Attack vest acquired. Anything in here? Nope. All right, let's figure out where the next guy is. Alright, century way over there. Let's go get him. Go in stealth mode. Nice and quiet. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. And bam! Take a nap. And there's one guy right here. And then we can go inside. And everything's gonna be perfect. Hey, buddy. Surprise! Oh my god. Oh shit, and we're so close, and now they, they see me now. Alright, cool. That wasn't so bad. I'm so bad. We got killed a lot of people without anybody noticing. This is a great start. Alright, we got a guy hiding behind the wall there and one right there. He's dead. Next! Right there. Oh, that's the guy we're trying to kill? Is this Charlie himself? He's definitely a point of interest. Got a big old star over his head. Hey, friend. 
I don't want to kill you, Charlie. I'm going to try to fight him. Jesus Christ! There we go. All right. Now listen up. I will recruit you to my racket. You're going to be a good boy. Work for me, and Make you might me some live money. long enough to raise your family. Okay, sure thing. Whatever you want. That's good, Charlie. Real good. Welcome to the family, Charlie. Smack racket secured. Nice, Lincoln. You did well today. Let's make a phone call. Bitch better have Since my money. The First Baptist Church. Those Dixie heathens have been handled. I'll have some of my men come right over. Nice. So now we, we own the brothel and we own the church. Hell yeah, we're getting our land back slowly, I guess. The hollow. We're getting rid of the Dixie Mafia and giving the Haitians control of it. Of course, for a large bit of the profit. There we go. Haitians tell me rolling up. They roll pretty deep. Please state your name for the record. Donovan. John. Mr. Donovan, you understand that by appearing before this committee, you have explicitly waived your constitutional rights in regards to counsel and self-incrimination. Sure. And you further acknowledge that by appearing before this committee, you agree to disclose all information pertaining to the events that occurred in New Bordeaux during the summer and fall of 1968. <laughs> I wouldn't be sitting here if I didn't. You were an operative in the Central Intelligence Agency from 1953 to 1969, is that correct? That's right. When did you arrive in Vietnam? August of 1961. Please describe for this committee the actions you took during your time in Vietnam. I spent a couple months in Saigon, then I was transferred to a base in Laos that was operated by the Special Activities Division. We trained and equipped the Hmong and then turned them loose on the NVA. We're running arms and supplies via the Ho Chi Minh Trail. And you worked with Lincoln Clay in what eventually became the Phoenix Program. Within a year or so, Lincoln was heading up his own PRU. We'd cross over into Vietnam and locate enemy targets and either kill them or bring them back for interrogation. <laughs> Just thinking about it? Jesus Christ. You wouldn't believe the shit we did to those cocksuckers. Well, there's our connection with Donovan. Uh, looks like we're old war buddies back in Vietnam. Did some sort of special ops program. So there we go, guys. That is it for episode five. We are getting back the hollow a little bit at a time. And we'll see what we have to do next. And I will Calling talk to you guys in the very next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I won't eat up.